Hello, and welcome to Horror and Monster Collectibles, where today we're going to be taking a look at the brand new Trick or Treat Studios Fluffy the Crate Beast prop replica. Now, this is from the segment The Crate from the movie Creep Show, and this is sculpted by the man himself, Tom Savini. So, let's go ahead and spin around this awesome art box and take a closer look. And here is Fluffy. Now he comes as a one piece. Uh, so there's no assembly required here. He is 23 inches tall and cast from resin. Although it is a hollow cast, this is not solid resin. And there was only uh, 500 made of this guy. And if I remember right, uh, Savini sculpted this quite a few years ago. I feel like it was in the early 2000s. I remember seeing pictures of him sculpting it. And I think it was around that time. I'm guessing about like 15 years ago or so. And I assume that uh, Trick or Treat Studios was just able to land um, this sculpt from Savini and cast and sold it. Here is the back. The well, back is flat, uh, relatively flat. As we can see, there is a wave to the back, but it does sit up against a wall or like a bookshelf rather well. And obviously there's nothing to critique here on sculpt work because it's all done by Savini and uh, you'd be an idiot to critique Savini on his own creation on how well he sculpted things. My only disappointment here uh, that I will critique though is that I wish that it had been painted. There is a paint paint up on here um, basically just uh, to add depth to the sculpt but that's about it um, this is more like a uh, just mimicking the the sculpt work that he did and not um, of a painted up piece I believe he did paint up the piece though um, or I have seen this piece painted up uh, in Savini's um, collection room at one point in time uh, so what I plan on doing uh, with him is painting him up and trying to duplicate that paint job as much as possible because while I like this I feel that it is still just a bit raw and I think he would look much better all painted up and it also gives me a fun project to do. But he is super rad and I love this movie so, so much. All right, guys, so that's about all there is to go over on this piece. Uh, again, it is incredibly rad. Uh, of course, just being a life-size bust of Fluffy itself, but on top of that being the sculpt from Savini himself, it doesn't really get much better than this and I'm really really happy that uh, Trick or Treat Studios came out with this. Now th this was released a couple months ago. Uh, I am late to the game. Uh, I was actually hesitant on getting this. Um, I don't know why. I think that just because I had if I I'd always had it in my mind that if I was going to get it then I was going to have to repaint it and uh, I just was kind of putting that off and I finally decided to go look on Sideshow and I had uh, about $250 in rewards points. So paid like $50 for this and I decided that I would be worth it. Um, it would have been worth it in the first place, but uh, I, for whatever reason, I was just kind of hesitant to take on another project. Um, but I think that this thing will look super rad all painted up and I will do a uh, tutorial on that uh, whenever I tackle that job, which will probably be sometime this year, I assume. 
And with only 500 being made, if you are a Creepshow fan or if you are a Savini fan, I highly recommend uh, picking up this piece. It will look super awesome in your collection room. And uh, I can't wait to get it painted up. I'm just gonna sit it up on my collection room for now and uh, just tackle a project at some point. And I know that it will look even better than how it looks currently. As always, feel free to leave any questions or comments that you might have, and I'll be happy to answer them. I assume that you guys love Creepshow <clears throat> or Savini, or you wouldn't be watching this. Um, again, uh, this is probably my favorite segment uh, of, the of the film, um, but really, honestly, all of them were great to me. Uh, and Creepshow too, uh, really, um, the raft was my favorite one, and I could take or leave the rest of them but uh, the original creep show was just solid all the way through and uh, it has remained a classic all these years what i will do is i will leave you with a 360 spin around of the bust and some studio shots as always feel free to like and subscribe and click the bell for notifications for new videos and i will see you guys later